Hey everybody, what's going on? I'm trying out the new camera um, Salty Shelf back sent me. I did one video before. I'm trying to figure out how to upload it on my Android uh, tablet. So that could take a while. I may have to go back to my parents' house, to mommy and daddy's, and use my laptop there because I get better results with my laptop. But, but I haven't tried the Android yet, so who, who knows? Who knows what will happen? I haven't done a video in a really long time, and I explained I had a problem. I couldn't talk for a long time, so now I just can't shut up. Um, so I've got a lot of stuff that I want to do reviews on, and I'll give you some of the things that I want to do reviews on. Uh, I want to do reviews on two Anchor products. One's the Anchor Classic uh, Bluetooth speaker, and the second one is the Anchor Soundcore uh, Bluetooth pre, uh, premium speaker. No, it's not called premium. Uh, sound cord speaker. Uh, both in and of themselves fantastic. So I'll save that for the review. Uh, now what we're reviewing here is it's a cowboy hat from Resist All. I like cowboy hats. I always love cowboy hats. I'm, I'm such a nerd. I watch cowboy movies with a cowboy hat on. I wear a cowboy hat pretty much everywhere I go. That or a ball cap. Um, so this one's from Resistol, and this is from the Jason Aldean collection. I gotta tell you, Jason Aldean is probably my absolute favorite uh, country artist. It used to be Toby Keith until I got a taste of uh, uh, Jason Aldean. You know, he's just like a regular guy, and he has a fantastic voice, and he has fantastic uh, lyrics in his songs, and I can relate to him, so. I won't get too deep into that. So I wanted to get this hat. I've been looking at this hat for like 60 days, and I kept putting it off, putting it off, putting it off. So I finally pulled the trigger on it, and I picked it up. Uh, this is a straw hat. I like straw hats better than felt hats. Uh, for me and my lifestyle, the felt hats don't work out very good. They get dusty. They got cat hair on them. They get all weird and funky shaped, and uh, they're very expensive. And I end up either smashing them and throw them away, or, or just never wearing them again. And then I, I recently bought one of the Outback Trading Company hats, and I, I, I was disappointed with that. So it's all weather. So if it's raining or something, I, I'm out in the woods. I'll wear it. But it's such an odd shape in comparison to the picture. It looks like I'm, I'm the freaking flying nun with it. It just looks weird. No matter how I try and shape it. It just gets weirder and weirder looking. So, since the day I bought it, it's been hanging on a hat hook because I refused to wear it because I put it on it looked like a dope. So this one, I bought it. It was hard to get, and I bought it a little bit uh, smaller than I normally wear. I usually wear a large, and uh, this one was a uh, seven and one eighth. So that was a little tight. But the thing about straw hats is, if you wet them or steam them, you can form fit them to your head. And this had to be uh, form fitted to the way I like it to be, uh, the way I like to wear it. And that's, that's a personal preference, uh, how you want to wear it. This is the way I wear my hat. I wear the sides up a little bit, and I wear the brim down to keep the sun out of my eyes. And I leave the back up like this to keep the sun off my neck. Um, and the other thing I like about straw hats is uh, they're light and if they get dirty or dusty or muddy or anything like that put it on your head hop in the shower uh, bing bang boom it's clean and uh, while you're in there you can even reshape it a little bit so they're very forgiving and they're, they're great hats so let's look at what we have here a really cool headband which is like you just don't see this is my first resist all hat um, on the inside You've got the Resistol logo, the Jason Aldean sweatband, and the Jason Aldean uh, bumper sticker in there. Bumper, uh, whatever you want to call it, logo. Um, really great hat, and I was, I'm really happy I bought it. I, it looks really cool on me. I hate saying stuff like that. It looks really cool on me. <coughs> but I do look pretty cool. Um, I did my first video with this. So I'm trying to figure out how to upload it. So, uh, is there anything else I want to do, say, or do? Uh, 
No, I need cracking on that. It's Fourth of July weekend. Look at my cowbell. This cowbell was $35. It's got a handle on it. It's also a bottle opener. I got it on sale for $2.30 in the bargain bin because the paint was sticking the ball to the inside of the bell. And the, the first genius that bought it could not figure that perplexing problem out. So instead of spending $30 on it, I got some cowbell for uh, $2.95, I think it was. You never have enough cowbell. Never. All right, guys, later.